If you've been experiencing pain or tightness in the inside portion of your leg, in your pubic bone, or you think you might have strained or pulled a muscle in your groin, you probably have a really tight adductor muscle. So this is one of the trickiest places in the entire body to foam roll. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to properly and easily foam roll your adductor. All right, so in order to foam roll your adductor, you're gonna need a foam roll and somewhere to foam roll. The inner side portion of our leg tends to be the hardest place on our body to foam roll. So I'm gonna show you a simple strategy that I like to do to really help isolate that muscle. And essentially, what you're gonna be doing is this type of position where your knees are out, but in the forward bent position. So this is more of like a downward frog leg stretch. So in this position with my knees fanned out, I'm gonna come up on my knees, and then right here on the inside part of my leg is where the adductor muscle is. So I'm gonna place the foam roll on the inside portion there on the side that is involved, so the side that is painful. And then as I feel that portion, you can apply your body weight down, applying pressure or compression, and this might be all you need in order to really help start to relieve the tension on your adductor or in into your groin. But if you really want to foam roll this, you're going to keep that involved side leg bent and straighten out your other leg. In this position, I am adding more tension or compression onto that inside adductor, and then from here, I can move my body weight back and forth like that to really help break up any of those tight muscle fibers on the inside portion of my groin and adductor. If I wanna do more of a pin and stretch, this is really tricky, but add some compression downward into the spot that is painful, and then in this position, I'm gonna straighten out that back leg and then bend my leg again. So it's kind of hard to see in this position, but I'm applying pressure down and then I'm straightening my leg all the way out and then coming all the way back. And that'll really help apply more of a pin and then stretch of that muscle group for you to help break up the adductor. So that is how I like to really help isolate that inner groin muscle, the adductor, which can really help provide relief to inner groin pain, pubic bone pain, that pubic symphysis, which is really beneficial for people who have had any sort of imbalance of their pelvis, some compensations in the front. Even after women have given birth, months later, if you're noticing tension on one side, it could have been because as things opened and then closed in an odd position, it's causing more of a tensioning on one side. So I hope this video is beneficial to you. Again, my name is Dr. Jordan Fairley. I appreciate any comments or feedback. Please share this video with your friends and I hope you find value. Take care.